What's up everybody, welcome to yet another episode of As Told by Gonzo, the YouTube channel where I talk about nerdy stuff, rather it's pop, vinyl, music, or the love and passion I have for film. Yes, it is that time of the week once again. Happy Monday to each and every one of you. In today's video, we are going to be reviewing 1981's Brian De Palma film, Blowout. Now, Blowout stars Nancy Allen and of course John Travolta. John Travolta plays Jack. He is this. Uh, he does sound effects for movies, low budget movies specifically. Um, and one night he's collecting sounds with his little recorder on his side and his uh, kind of microphone. So he ends up on this bridge and uh, he witnesses and gets the sound of a car going off the road and going into the creek underneath the bridge. After the fact, uh, a government official approaches him and just tells him, hey, just forget about all this. You know, you didn't save anybody. Because the other person that was in the car is a government official that's running for governor. And so, he, you know, he doesn't really think anything of it at first, but then he really, he really looks into it. There was another person at the scene that got a lot of pictures, so he kind of hunts down those pictures and with the sound, kind of makes like a short little film with the sound and with the pictures and him and Nancy Allen's character have to figure out, you know, why this all happens, why they want to cover it up, who's responsible, who, what actually happened, why the, the car spun out. And it's just this really intense crime drama that I was completely blown away by and I loved Blowout. Film is beautifully shot. Um, there's a lot of uh, very different techniques that Brian De Palma and of course the DP use. Uh, they use a lot of split screen I noticed. They use a lot of combined shots where like for example um, when two characters are having an interaction it'll show like Brian De Palma's face like right here and then like a wide angle shot of the other person you know far far away but they combine the shot so it looks like they're interacting but they're really not even close to each other a specific scene that really stuck out that's really well shot is um, I don't want to spoil anything but a character is, is, is killing another character and the way they shot it was just through shadows all you see is him stabbing the the character in a, in a shadow it's backlit with a red light and just the way they shot it, it's only like a split, like three seconds that you see the shot, but that one specific shot really stuck out. And that's really how the whole movie is. It's focusing really hard on storytelling and also the way, you know, the photography of the film. Um, you can see that Brian De Palma really put his heart and soul into this movie and it really shows on the screen. From the performances to the way it's shot, it's incredible. There are a few action scenes at the end, but nothing like, you know, amazing. Um, so it's like a, it's not really even a slow burn. It's really fast paced. Again, I don't want to spoil anything, but another shot that really stuck out was there's this part where John Travolta is kind of in his office and the, the camera focuses on him, but is constantly turning through the whole scene. And it's just one take. You learn so much about John Travolta's character, where he works how he's just organized as the character and just everything that surrounds him and it really does make the scene a lot better. What I took away from Blowout is it's a lot of conspiracy theory and also how much control government officials really have over everybody. How much they have control with people, how much control they have with the actual police and just as a society if you were put in that situation, would you do the right thing or would you just go with whatever the government tells you and just kind of blow it off? I really want to get into more of Brian De Palma's films. I've only seen, uh, once again, Blowout. I've seen Scarface and I do have, and I do own and have seen Sisters. Definitely check out Blowout. I really enjoyed it. Um, and that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, once again, if you want to check me out on my social media sites, facebook.com slash as told by Gonzo and Instagram at nerdcore for Gonzo. I will keep those links down below. And uh, once again, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And I will see you guys next week. See you later.